You might think pixels are the only way to build websites. Maybe you think they're just the easiest. REM can be just as easy, but brings one big benefit. This is Vite's default page. So everything seems fine, but it does not if you're a visually impaired user, because these people change the default font size of their browser. And if we do that, nothing happened. Why? Because you use hard-coded pixel values. They will just ignore whatever the user changed. And that is exactly where REM comes into play. REM calculates the base font size based on the root element. We see that we have defined a font size of 16 pixels. So one REM, that equals 16 pixels. And to make calculations easier, you use 10 pixels. By doing that, we can change into 5.2 REM and the font size of the button becomes 1.6 REM and the padding 1.5 and 1.9. And still, everything looks exactly the same. But there's one small change we still need to do. Instead of setting this hard-coded value to 10 pixels, you use 62.5%. Now everything became bigger, and that is because we are still using the large font size. We change it back, then everything is exactly the same. But now everything is a relative to the setting the user set. This is super important for accessibility. This way, way more people can use the web.